Yo, what's up guys? In this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to download Pocket Squad and how to be able to play Steam Workshop maps like this one right here on the Epic Games version of Rocket League. So let's get right into it. So the first thing we're gonna do is download Bacchus Mod. So type in BacchusMod.com and I'm gonna have the links in the description to all of these websites, but go ahead and load it up, BacchusMod.com. It's gonna pop up this screen right here. You're gonna click download now. It's gonna pop up something on the bottom left. When it finishes downloading, you're just gonna open it. You're gonna let it run. And then after it's done doing everything, it's gonna automatically install into Rocket League. So now the next thing we wanna do is we wanna find our Rocket League folder. And the easiest way to do that, if you don't know where it's at, down here on the bottom left, just type in Rocket. So right here is our file folder you want to click on that right here where it says ta game double click on this and the folder file we're looking for is called cooked pc console if you can't find this folder right here the easiest way to find that is click on this pc and then on here on the top right you're going to type in cooked pc console and after it finishes loading what you want to do is pin your cook pc console folder file to your quick access so now that you've done that we're going to do the next thing so we're going to be downloading the workshop textures so go ahead and load up this website link in the description you can just scroll down and right here where it says download you're going to click on that and after it finishes downloading you're going to go back into your folders and you're going to go to where it says downloads and right here where it says workshop textures you're going to open that but first you want to open up a new window open up a new window drag it to the right and on the right screen you're going to click on cook pc console and then go back to this screen workshop textures you're going to open it and then you're going to highlight all of these right here and then you're going to drag all of these over here to the cook pc console file and just like that you have the textures downloaded now the next thing we want to do is go to the steam workshop community map so this is where you're going to be downloading your your maps so you click on workshop whatever you want to download we're going to download a ring map so you type in ring map then you click search and then whatever map you want to download click on whatever map you want to download we're going to be downloading this one right here this is the download code up here so you're going to highlight this you're going to hit Control c to copy the link now you're going to go to the steam workshop downloader you're going to hit Control v and then this is the map we want to download right here so right here you click download so now that it's done downloading you want to open up your two screens again and it's this one right here this is the rings map that we just downloaded so you're going to right click on this you're going to extract it to right here click on this one it's going to extract it and it's going to give you another folder the folder it just gave us you delete that and then you're going to right click on this again and you're going to open it and it's going to give you these files right here and the one that we want is the udk file so now we're going to go over to the cooked pc console on this screen you're going to scroll down until you get to labs we're at the labs you want to choose a map that you don't really play on at all so we're going to be choosing the labs underscore circle pillars underscore p dot upk you're gonna right click you're gonna rename it i like the whole entire thing Control c to copy that then you go back over to this screen on this side and you highlight the udk file and you hit Control v so now that you have it copied you hit enter labs underscore this one right here you're gonna drag this to the cook pc console so drag it over there it's gonna say destination already has a file replace the file in the destination so we put it on circle pillars now what you want to do is make sure your Bacchus mod thing is loaded up so you can start Rocket League. Go ahead and start up Rocket League. So now that your Rocket League has loaded up, we're going to go into play. You're going to go into train and you're going to click on the map that you renamed it on. So you're going to click on pillars. And boom, just like that. So yeah, guys, if you guys found this video helpful, if you guys could drop a like and, you know, comment below if this video helped you out. And thanks for watching, guys.